Sorry, gentlemen, but we're closed. We're not here for milkshakes, miss. We understand you may be harboring criminals in this establishment. Our colleagues in Centerville identified some trespassers in their town after dark, gave pursuit. Last they saw, the criminals were headed this way. Well, we don't have any criminals here, though we do have a young family. But the last time I checked, Riverdale was not yet a sundown town. True, but Centerville is, and they broke the law there, so those trespassers are coming with us. And we'd be happy to come in and get them. Do you have a warrant? No, I do not. Well then, you're not stepping foot inside this diner. Because I know what happens when people are arrested for violating sundown laws. They vanish, and worse. Well, I think I'd like to speak to your boss. I'm right here. And let me just reiterate, no one is coming into my diner without a warrant. Well, in that case, if you don't mind, we'll just wait here while I radio Centerville. Have them drop that arrest warrant. Should be here first thing in the morning. Then we'll conclude our business and justice will be done. Radio Centerville deputy and uh, settle in. It's gonna be a long night. I can't interfere directly. It's one of the rules. It's Christmas Eve. You're an angel. Isn't this the one night of the year you can and should get involved? What would you have me do? Something you said earlier, that if I saw your real form, it would drive me insane. Did you mean that literally? Yes. Your eyes would start to bleed and your mind would snap in two. Does that mean the sheriff's mind would snap in two as well? All right, I'll see what I can do. Oh, thank you, Raphael, thank you. But just give me a second. I want to call Chief Andrews, and then I will bring everybody back here. I, I told them to hang back, away from the doors. You can't see this either. I won't. And thank you, Raphael. Chief Andrews is going to meet us and help get you home, but we have to make a detour first. What happened to them? Come on, let's keep moving. Titus will call and have them picked up. I thought you'd be here burning the midnight oil, Mr. Mayor. Well, it has been a restless Christmas Eve for me. I didn't get a chance to fully explain myself at that meeting before. So... I thought I'd introduce you to some friends. This is Tracy, Flynn, and their daughter, Annie. Tonight, they were hunted down like criminals for being caught in Centerville after dark. They are why you can't let Sheriff Perkins turn Riverdale into a sundown town. It would cost Riverdale its soul, Mr. Mayor. <laughs> 